Okay. And welcome to the next game that we're going to be looking at. Hopefully we have a little bit more success functioning... Fun with fun <laughs> I do apologise, right? For, for, for Monster Buck Hunter or whatever the fuck it, whatever the fuck it was called. Cabela's, yeah, Monster Buck Hunter. I do, I do apologise about that one. Hopefully Cabela's Big Game Hunter 2012 we have a little bit more success with on the Nintendo Wii. Uh, this game was also released on PS3 and Xbox 360, and it was released in September 2011. Um, the game is developed by Cauldron, which is generally the developer that took on the Cabela license, um, basically when Sangreen Studios dropped it. I think Fun Labs did a few games, just like obviously with Monster Bug Hunter. Um, and on Game of it just says that this game is developed and published by Activision. Well, no, Activision is the publisher, obviously, but no, this version is published by Cauldron. It's uh, published, developed by Cauldron. I'll get there. I'll get there. I am tired. Okay. Developed by Cauldron. And, um... Can you shut your fucking whore mouth? God. I just sort of, I know the music's just really loud to me, and it's not every game, it's just certain games just ha I, I don't obviously mix their sound properly. Proper, <laughs> properly. Again, I am tired. I am trying. You might hear me s fucking mix my words up. That is what happens when you are tired. Why am I tired? I suffer with insomnia. There you go. So... Let's move on, shall we? And see what this game is like. Right, there is a cursor in the middle of the screen. Alright, you see the cur there is a cursor in the middle of the screen. But it's not moving. Now I can use this to create a profile, which is the nunchuck or the D-pad. But it's alarming that the... Uh... I have a feeling, right? I've just got a feeling. I'm going to try mi mixing something up here. I think I had this issue before, strangely enough. Well, basically, I don't have enough USB slots on my fucking computer, right? No one does. So I have this little bar that has a bunch of USB 3.0s, but also has some 2.0s. Now, I've plugged the, the, the Wii sensor bar in a USB 2.0, and I have a feeling that it doesn't like it. So now I've plugged it into a USB 3.0, and let's see whether or not that makes a difference not an issue with the sensor bar. I know the sensor bar works fine. Oh! It is! There you go! That was the issue! Again, I apologize for Monster Buck Hunter. I'm not re-recording that video. That part. But yeah, it is. It's because it was in fucking USB 2.0. That's the reason. Fucking piece of shit. You can see it, the cursor kind of shaking a little bit. That's me. Uh, my hands shake like fuck. So I can't control that. Um, I will use this, though, to select, because it's just easier. But I know the cursor's working, so that's good. Thank fuck for that. So that's the reason. I'll try and have to remember that for next time. Cause it's been a while since I've played a Wii game. Last time I played it was... I know I did it for the vac vacation sports, but it was only one game, and it's not likely that I'm going to remember. Select profile. Yep. Choose your control style. So there you go. I like that. This game actually shows you the peripheral. Peripheral. So that's the peripheral you would have had. If you bought it with the game. Because obviously each one of these Cabela games have got sold on the Wii. As well as being sold. Actually I don't know. Yeah it was only on the Wii until the PlayStation Move came out. And then obviously they started doing peripherals. Because they could work it with the Move. or it had. They, they said the game features the Move for example. But that's what it would have looked like. In all fairness, that's a pretty cool looking peripheral. It's better than the fucking zapper, that's for sure, certain, isn't it? What we're going to do, we remote and nunchuck. So that's what we're going to do. Um, I just want to do galleries. One player. So there you go. So there is a story mode. Um, I don't know if there's going to be actually a hunt. Looks like there's just a gallery mode. We'll, we'll have a look, but we'll try the Mexican camp. Looks like you could have done it with multiple players, up to four players. Yeah, look, there you go. It's like a gallery mode. We'll try it with this. And then we'll actually, we'll probably have a little go on the story just to see if that changes anything. So here we are. Hmm, graphically speaking. Mm. 
My aim's going to be fucking terrible. So this is fine. And there we go. There we're getting there. You might, I'm not saying much because I'm kind of focusing on the. Uh, it works. Like I said, the game works. I don't have an issue with it. Oh, I've got my... Oh, but not my fault I hit the fucking explosive. The game's kind of lagging a little bit now, as you can see. And there we go. I think we've uh, completed the gallery part. Hey, we got three stars. We did pretty good. Rifle accuracy was 70%. That's not too bad. Cool. Pressing, he said press Z, and I, I don't know why, but I was pressing B. <laughs> don't, ask, don't ask me, I don't know. All right. Let's just do, let's try the story. I'm, what's the deal? Like, I'm, I'm, less, I'm tracking in the tundra. It's very snowy, it's very cold. Oh! No, someone's hunting me! Oh, it's a bear. I got him. There's the bear boy. There's the boonie bears. I'm gonna get him. Oh! Another hunter comes out! What? What is this, fucking Yakuza 5? <laughs> it's fucking Yakuza 5. That's literally Saigama's Saigama fucking part. Oh, you believe it or not, I'm on vacation right now. Are you sure? Getting in touch with nature. So you go hunting. That's not how you get in touch with nature, you fucking degenerate. I'm gonna die. And I'm gonna die. Next year, I'm going to Hawaii. And two... What the heck am I doing hunting a man killing grizzly in the middle of a blizzard? A very good question. I imagine the fucking fucking that bloke from Yakuza 5 <laughs> that that fucking Sageima had to go and fucking it's an exclusive save him club for elite big game hunters from all over the world. Every year the order hosts a competition. A hand-picked crew of world-class hunters pits their skills against one another while touring some of the most exclusive blah blah blah. Oh my god. What the fuck? Ah! <laughs> it came up with an error message and failed. Well, there we go. We can't play the story.
because <laughs> because the fucking error message on the emulation and it failed. Hey, we at least had a go at the gallery mode and the gallery mode seemed all right. Um, yeah, I guess that's that. Let's uh, let's just let's just yeah, let's just move on, shall we? Big game hunter. Hey, it works. You know, fair enough. Whatever. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. <laughs>